I love it when they freeze. Because then they can't hit me back. I'm not really going to be needed to five. Yeah, let's do that. All right. I'm ready for this boss battle. Mm -hmm. He's not resistant to it. He's the only one. But... I also kind of wanted to make the first boss battle like easy. And then he's gonna ooh, burn me. Icy, icy, icy. Get that. Alright. Remain silent. You don't know who I am, Chief. So slow. I gotta speed him up. Alright, we're back. He's healing me, he's healing me, he's healing me. This is our um this is arena gym. It's gonna be like a gym battle in Pokemon. There's four gyms in total. <gasps> I was not paying attention. Water, some food, sleep. Uh that we could handle a little bit later. But for right now. Let's just go ahead and buy some water. I'll buy 31 water. No, that's fine. Okay, so I'll just go ahead and do this. I really wish I had better spells than what I got, but beggars can be choosers. Beggars certainly cannot be. Won't even know it's an RPG Maker game. That's what I'm planning. Oh shoot! That's what I'm planning on. nice I feel like I need well oh um I kind of changed how the stats work too health only gives you health mana only gives you mana physical gives you um one attack and then um a quarter um defense so you need four physical in order to get one point of um defense the reason why I did that because I want the player to depend heavily on armors versus um their stats, um when it comes to defending and stuff like that, um and then obviously the same thing for magic where it only boosts your MAT by one, and then it boosts your MDF by um a quarter, um so you could rely more on your armor. So that way health and mana is more important, and then. You know, oh yeah, I just leveled up to, which is weird because I just leveled up. Uh, let me see. Stats. Gear. Stats. All right, okay. Let me go ahead and heal up. Mainly because I know what's about to happen. Thirsty pretty fast in the game. By design, of course. Uh, so you always got to make sure you keep some water on you. Some food too, but you don't get as hungry. And food generally gives you more food per eat, per bite, versus food per drink. Ooh. Oh, it's a fun goblin. Something I added. They give you a lot of gold when they die. 
but they run away from you and hide. Ooh, no, that's not the word. Never mind. So yeah, if you find any of those, try to ooh, try to kill them fast. All right. Let me see here. Oh, stranger occurrences. Report back to Axel. Okay, well, I know what to do. So it wants me to report back to um back to Hollow Tip because remember. We got the quest to capture the bandit, but the guys turned it in for me while I did this other quest. Um, I could have went to go complete it, complete that one if I wanted to, but I kind of wanted to just get that over with. All right. So after that's done, you know what happens. Look at what quests open up. Long live the king. High Lord Suron is dead and his heir is kidnapped. In order to uh, get aid from them, I must help. Dead rising, the necromancers terrorizing the gray, and then in, um, in order to get aid from them, I must help. Uh, and then all in his head, the Lord Cross has gone, has gone mad. You must get to the bottom of things in order to get aid from the Chris. So I think we're gonna do Dead Rising right now. So let's go ahead and uh, I can't track it because I haven't. Um, I haven't um, gotten that far yet. I only have the first section of the game trackable. But we need to kind of skip time here. I think I took that off. Yeah, we need to skip time because it's still like the first day. It's only 5 p.m. Let me make sure I get this. Activate it. Go to the magic shop. I don't remember if he had anything for me to buy, but no, he didn't have anything for me to buy. Oh, wait, he did. He did. He did. He did. He did. He did. Actually, you know what? I like the mix of stuff that I have now. A little bit of a um, defense with, um, you know, a lot of mana and magic. So let's stick with what we have here uh, until we get better stats, at least. So let's go ahead and go through this again. This guy's gonna check. I just I was looking for Locker, the wizard. Okay, so he's in Edgewood, investigating something. Let's head over to Edgewood. Oops, wrong little corridor. Edgewood, Edge. Oh, Edgewood has the twins. The guardians will walk and defeat them to proceed. Edgewood has the twins. <laughs> I forgot all about Edgewood. Alright, let me see. Because I don't see how something like that. So the only thing I could think of is that, hey, Star Reflect is supposed to reflect um where the damage is coming from. So maybe it doesn't know that the damage isn't coming from where it normally comes from. If that makes sense. I don't know. Hopefully that's the issue and it doesn't crash again. But if it does crash, we got to go back to the drawing table. Oh. Twin B is dead. So what you really want to do is kill Twin B first because he's a lot squishier than Twin A. And then you could just take your time and kill Twin A. But yeah, I think that was the issue. All right, we're back in. We got through the twins. Jesus. <laughs> okay, that worked out. We're in Edgewood. Do we want to go explore Edgewood or do we want to just, yeah, let's just do this. All the bugs. But those bugs let us know that the game is, that's when it's a problem. Yes, quest. Yes, I got the replica. 
Use the key to get to the first part of the chambers of Castle Frost. You will need the other one. One of my guards should have it. Okay, let's go find this dumb guard that has it. X 6.24 p.m. Wow, okay. He's on patrol? Where is he at? He's at the pub. Pub, pub, pub. Ooh, yeah, he is. Frost. Because Frost. Oh, he's drunk, drunk. All right, drink, drink, drink again. Ooh, how did I end up here? I must return to the way that was. Yeah, how did I end up here? Where am I? I'm in Dawnhaven. Oh, I'm by. All right, I got everything I ever wanted. They want me to just blindly rush into the next battle. We will not be doing that. We will be going to the shop. We're going to see if this lady or man or whatever it is has some. Um, also, need to sleep. All right, so we killed the boss. I do want to get those chests over there, so let's go ahead and backtrack. Backtrack, backtrack. Backtrack, backtrack. Ooh, that was clutch. All right. Guy, he turned it. They keep turning their backs on me. Got him, got him, got him, got him. All right. Empty wall. Empty. Ooh, something shitty. All right.
Let's go. Level. All right, and that's gonna be the end of today's playthrough because that's pretty much the last of the content. Well, not the last. There's some hidden stuff that you guys haven't seen, but in order to show you, I will have to like dig deep. And that's not the best time to do that. So, I'm just going to kind of bypass all of this, return back to town. Some of these enemies, well, the enemies do respawn, so they're respawning. So, let's go back out. So, you guys have seen the game, what it's like so far. You've seen the open world. Again, like I said, I'm trying to give it the scavenging feel. If you guys have that same feeling, let me know. Ooh. No, fight bandit. Is he dumb? How much does he hit? He could kill us in one hit. Let's see. Nah, he weak. He's weak. Look at how weak he is. Kill this guy. Kill this guy. Faster, because I kind of realized that I want that. Um, Time is passing too slow. Ooh, fun goblin. I also got to make them faster. But yeah, they're supposed to disappear and reappear somewhere else. And they'll do that five times. If you don't catch them within that five times, they'll um, disappear. But yeah. That quest isn't complete, by the way. That's the like literally where I left off. Um, I still got to complete it. Set all the markers where they're supposed to go. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, for those of you guys who are not subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe. It definitely does help us out a lot. Um, Patreon, the link down is the link is down below. Make sure to subscribe. Um, depending on the level of subscriber you are on my Patreon, I will add you into the game. Um, but you know, no matter what level you are, you will be gaining access to the game when it does come. Uh, when the alpha come out uh, next week on the 8th I believe so that's in 5 days so guys 5 days I hope you guys are, are as excited as I am but without further ado we played for about an hour realistically maybe 2-3 hours because we got a lot but we made it and then once the stores open up, there should be new stock. I'm also going to make the guards chase you 
Like, let's say, for example, if the guard is next to you and you pick the lock and he can see you, um, guess what? He's going to chase you. But, yeah, that's it for the video. Thank you guys again for watching. I know I didn't show you that many spells and all that variations, but trust me, there's tons of stuff in the game. Um, more content is on the way. Thank you guys again. Peace.